Well, y'all, I just wanted to say that sometimes it's ugly. And I might have to make some videos about some things that seem bizarre to you and hoot and holler and complain and bitch and moan real loud and raise a big stink. But I was finally able to log into my city account. I've been trying for like, it's been like a week and a half now. And you know, I use the same exact password. That is my password. That is the very first password I tried to use and have been unable to log in or change, try to do a, a password retrieval, like change my password since they were denying my password. And people will ask, well, why don't you call them? Well, what happens, such as when my first Republic account was, I was like locked out of it with fraud alerts wrongfully. You know, they had my correct, I wasn't making purchases out of my zip code or anything. And then they wrongfully shut down my primary debit card that I had with First Republic Bank, which by the way, some of you all know what happened to First Republic Bank. But what would happen is I'll call and I'll have errors. That I'll, I'll talk to the customer service and there'll be errors that come up. With American Express, I got locked out of American Express for a while. Okay. So I ended up having to, what, what was it? my dishwasher because I got locked out of everything and my debit card, my, you know, everything. I ended up having to put it on my Discover card, which is not what I want to be doing because my, my bank wasn't working. So I've been trying to log into the city account to make some transfer situation stuff go on. And I've been trying for a week and a half. I finally got in after making these videos about these psychopaths. And this has happened in the past where they've even like sent me um, and through American Express, they sent me unsolicited password resets, all this stuff and locked me out of my account. And when I called customer service, their whole system was taken down. It's like when I tried to have my Honda key cut, the entire national Honda dealership key programming system got torn down. And this is just a psychopath that I deal with. So the very same initial password. Same password. Finally works after I raise a stink. And now I gotta take care of my business because I don't know when the next time I'll be able to get into this account will be. It'll be whenever the psychopaths decide that I'm allowed to log into this account again. And this is the clown world that we're living in. And if you think this is weird stuff, if you've never had to live through this kind of psychotic, deranged persecution and harassment, then just be, be thankful.